Hi guys, welcome to Grove Garden. Today we're going to be making a lovely uh, Spanish omelette. Really easy to make and minimal ingredients as you can see, super easy. So pan on the heat, it's nice and hot, non-stick, small one. You need to get one that can actually go in the oven because you don't want to melt your handle. So what we need to do is just do a bit of veg prep. So I've got red pepper, you can't get any more Spanish than red pepper. So just gonna cut it into strips. Cut it into small dice. And then once that's diced up, we're gonna go over the onion. Now you guys all know how we cut onions around here. Three quarters of the way. Keep that thumb behind your index finger. Butter. Who doesn't like butter? Straight in the pan. We're gonna melt, 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 butter, butter. You know when butter melts, don't you just think like, yeah. Seriously, it's a chefy thing, like when butter melts, it's great, it's a great feeling because it means the pan's hot. <laughs> uh, Don't you get that feeling at home? As a musician, <laughs> I can appreciate it, the feeling, but I don't usually get the same sensation. <laughs> a little bit of oil in there. Then we're gonna go in with meat onions, because they take the longest to cook. Oh my god. You need a, you need a dance channel, <laughs> through <Drew's> garden. <laughs> okay, so, nicey softened and clear, kind of getting to this jam-like consistency. Then we're going to add our red pepper. So once the red peppers are nice and soft, we're going to go in with me eggs, six eggs, free range eggs, mix them together. We're going to go in with a smoked paprika, about a teaspoon of smoked paprika, a little bit of olive oil, Seasoning, salt and pep, bit of parsley, just rip that up, mix it together and then we're going to go straight in the pan over here. Now it's really important that you make sure the onion is kind of flat so it's all over the, the top so when you present it you can see it. Pour it all over. While that's going we can chop some tomato, cherry tomatoes in half. Once the egg is just set around the side, put it onto a medium heat, pop the lid on, and go let that cook away and take over for about 10 minutes and then I'll check on it. So once it's just set around the sides, it's a little bit soft in the middle, just pop your tomatoes. And we're gonna pop it in the oven at 180 for 10 minutes. Okay, so it's just come out of the oven. It's nice and firm. And we're gonna do the da -da 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 -da, flippity flip flip. Ready? Ooh. Nice one. It's caught a bit of colour, but that's okay. The creme fresh. This is optional. If you're on a diet, obviously don't put it on there, but I'm not on a diet. So. Do you know anyone who's on a diet? So many people. What? People that I don't like. <laughs> I don't hang around with people on diets. Bit of parmesan. That's it, guys. Your Spanish omelette with creme fraiche, parmesan, tomatoes. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe. Link below, and I'll see you next Thursday.